Hi, this is Danielle with Blue Moon Estate Sales of Northwest Houston. We are here this weekend in Montgomery, just north of 1488 in the neighborhood of Wood Forest. Our sale is going to be this Friday and Saturday, March 31st and April 1st. We open at nine o'clock both days. There are no appointments required for this sale. This is an open, just come line up type sale. And let's go inside and take a look around. This is a gorgeous, up-to-date home. Everything is very trending, very modern, very up-to-date. In fact, most of the furniture is less than a year old. We're gonna go upstairs first. As we head to the top of the stairs, we're going to see the living room. And in the living room, we have this really nice sofa. Great neutral color. You could put any kind of accent pillow on that to make it pop. Coffee table. And then we also have a matching chair and side tables that match the coffee table. Turn around behind me and you'll see the TV. I believe this is a, it's a Sony, but I believe it's a 55 inch or close to that inch TV. You can see that it's got a great picture. Obviously there's no internet or no cable, so we can't watch anything, but you can see that the screen is in really good condition. There is a sound bar as well. And then check out the entertainment center that it's on. This is so unique. It's wood and iron. And you can see the wheels on the bottom. And then they've got their electronic components, Onkyo disc player and Sony um, receiver. And then we have a bunch of records over here. We've got some Roku sets, also more records on this side. Lots of little cute decor items. And then behind me, there are some CDs. And then look at the little rack that those are on, also with the wood and the iron. There's a Sony turntable. And then these are some of our nicer purses. There's Brighton, there's Michael Kors, um, Coat, some different purses. let's step into the kitchen and as we head into the kitchen you see the island I'm gonna just kind of walk around the island first up these cute little bar stools there's two of these guys and then in the kitchen we've got some decor items but then also some great kitchen items this is a set of Hinkle's knives we have some Polish pottery We have some mud pie sets and some Ray Dunn. You guys have seen this advertised as the Ray Dunn house. I haven't even begun to show you how much Ray Dunn is in this house. If you like Ray Dunn, you better run to this sale because there is a lot in all, almost all the Ray Dunn is brand new. Like these little sifters. These are Ray Dunn, all new, chopper, fruitcake, berries, all kinds of goodies in there. This is where we have our utensils, some flatware, some knives, there's some good knives in here. There's a Cutco in there, there's a couple really good knives in there. This is a view from the back side. And then around the main part of the kitchen, we have these sets of dishes. There's some really pretty chargers. Some Texas Ranger gear, a Keurig. Martha Stewart nesting bowls. We've got Pampered Chef in this house. Lots of name brands, lots of name brands. There's some Starbucks mugs in here. There's some 
great cutting boards, double boiler, and all of this enamelware, all this blue, really pretty enamelware, and then some of the pieces are cast iron. Those, this is a cast iron enamelware set. And then there's a lodge cast iron pot as well. Set of Rachel Ray pots and pans. And then we have some dishes with some cute coordinating bowls. Mugs and glasses. Some Pier 1 mugs. More glassware. We have this GE fridge, stainless fridge. I'm gonna step back a little bit so we can see it. It's got the dispenser on the door and it's got the drawer on the bottom. Bunch of waters in there, but you can see how clean it is. Clean on the bottom too. In the pantry is where we put a lot of our small appliances. Let's start from the top. We also have some bases and some canisters. Then we have some small appliances down here, some crock pots, some grills, toaster, coffee maker, blender, plasticware, good stuff like that. On the door, there's some coffee mugs and some food items. Let's head over into the dining area. In the dining area, you'll see this gorgeous table. This is a nice wood table. It's got the metal, again, the wood and the metal legs. You can see the edge. It's kind of, it's not a true live edge, but it's got that, you know, not straight edge and it's really nice and smooth. Comes with four chairs and the bench. And you see the brand on the bottom, it's River City Foundry, it says. Really nice table. We have a Dyson Animal Vacuum with attachments. And then over here, lots of decorative Christmas items, holiday items, but items for the kitchen. And then downstairs, there's even more holiday decor, more for the house. The Santa plate is a Fitz and Floyd. I love the little candy cane trees. This is the best time of year to get Christmas stuff because it's the time of year that nobody else is really thinking about it. And so you can get some really great deals. Look at these Santa plates. Yeah, these Santa plates are mud pie too. Okay, so let's head down the hall to the bedroom. Again, there's our TV. This really nice, huge wall clock. We have a vacuum cleaner. And then this washer and dryer, Whirlpool washer and dryer. Some more like laundry things. Head down the hallway to the master, the main bedroom. See, so we have a queen size bed, the white wood, Whitewash wood, headboard, footboard. Coordinating nightstand and accent chair. And another little chair. I turn the opposite way, there is another blue cabinet. Some lamps. And then we have two dressers. We have a large, tall dresser and then a longer dresser. Another TV, another Sony. Clothing items. Here's the other matching nightstand and 
rocker. This antique desk is not part of the sale. As we move into the bathroom, you'll see this is where we have a lot of our linens. We have other purses and wallets down here. Some clothing items that were pulled out. There's a lot of good, you know, trending clothing here. I'll show you some more in the closet in a minute. So first aid items. First aid kits. Lots of jackets and coats. And then you can see more clothes up here. And some cute, cute shoes in this house. You can see the little baseball kids. We've got tennis shoes or some Michael Kors high heels. Some Reef Converse. Lots of good brands. There's some L.L. Bean and some Uggs. Some of these clothes still are new with the tags on them, haven't even been worn. This house has two patios, so I'll show you the upstairs patio first. The upstairs patio, there's a few little plants, and then we have a little wicker love seat with a table. And then we go inside, downstairs I'll show you the other items that are in the downstairs patio. All right, so we've come downstairs to the bottom level. So the first bedroom in here has some little cute Ray Dunn signs. There's a whole bunch of these. There's more in the garage I'll show you. Some Christmas, some Valentine's. There's lots of different ones. These are cute for Easter, like a little garland. There are some lamps, an ottoman, and a set of nightstands. This big pretty mirror. And then a wing back chair and some frames. This is a really nice quilt as well. I like the scallop edging. Okay, now let's go into kind of the game room area. So we have these really cute yellow barrel, well, they're barrel chairs, but these very modern looking chairs. And then I love the artwork that goes with them, all the yellow and the sunflowers. And again, to keep with the theme of the wood and the iron, the iron lamp, and then the wood little table in between. And then if I turn around and show you the bookcase, check out this bookcase. It's also wood and iron. Very modern, very up to date. Tons and tons and tons of books. We have vintage books. We've got new books. We've got lots of novels. We've got some games. Lots of stuff on here, uh, paper, trash can, and then over here is some of our office supplies. So we've got a filing cabinet, and then on the built-in cabinet here, you see we have several monitors, scanner, paper shredders. Um, this is a big Samsung speaker, another monitor, printer, router, and behind is another small little Sony TV. There's some things up here in the cabinets as well. And then we have this desk. This is a great little work desk, little student desk. It's got a drawer in the front and a nice little chair. And then we have, remember I said we had Christmas decor down here. So this is more like the home decor where upstairs was things in the kitchen. So you can see all of the home decor. And all of this is such good quality. It's you know, up to date. I swear I've seen some of this stuff in um, TJ Maxx and Home Goods just this year. And then here are the Ray Dunn ornaments. These are new in the box. There's all different kinds. There is Christmas, there's dogs, there's bees, there's gnomes. There's just all different sets of these. Really good prices. Some more decor items. And then I love this little entertainment center or cabinet. It's got like a barn door 
thing on the front of it so you can slide it back and forth to open it. It's really, really cute. Okay, let's head into the bedroom. The other bedroom downstairs, we have a queen size bed in here. And we have loaded it with pillows. There are so many Christmas pillows, more decorative pillows. This is a cute little Christmas um, quilt with two pillow shams that come with it. And then we have, you know, our everyday sunshine pillows. And then we also have Christmas and fall different kinds of pillows in there. These cute little nurse stuffies. Another wood and iron side table and then more Christmas decor in here, more Ray Dunn, some stockings, and then uh, let me, oh, ornaments down here, and then let me show you the bed. The bed has a wrought iron, you know, metal base, and it's it's really quite cute. And then the, the headboard, there are pictures of this as well, has that same scallop detail on it. Against the wall, we have all of our holiday linens. Placemats, tablecloths, tea towels, table runners, just all kinds of different holiday linens. The back patio out here. There is a full-size wicker sofa and little table, as well as several pet carriers. Some pots and plants, some coolers, there's some chairs way over there, and some bins. So let's head to the garage. So I have to say, when you think of a garage and estate sale, you are not thinking of what we have in our garage. We have a Ray Dunn store in our garage. This is loaded with Ray Dunn items. We do have some normal stuff. We do have some luggage, but look at this table and all of the Ray Dunn, these are mug sets. Some more of those signs. If you are looking for a gift for somebody, a teacher's gift, you know, just a thank you gift, little employee, you know, thank you gifts. I mean, Mother's Day is coming up. Easter's coming up. Oh, I have to show you all of the Easter mugs. I mean, you can see some of these. Hop to it. Happy Easter. But look at, look at all these mugs. We have the tall metal ones, and we have the ceramic ones with the lids. And then, I mean, just look at, here, maybe I'll pan the top. Fight like a girl, flower child mom, boss mom. And that's just the top. And then the bottom, there's just so many. Follow the bunny, hello spring. I think my kids would get a pick out of that one. Mom's favorite. Hashtag mom life. There's just, oh, there's so many. You just have to get in here and dig to find them. There's a bunch of Easter ones. I thought this one was cute. Home is where dad is. <laughs> Follow your heart. Start with yes. And then over here, there's even more Ray Dunn. Some little boxes and some mugs with uh, wooden tops on them. We have some fall items. These are some dog and cat ones. You had me at Woof. And then there's uh, Snoopy. Peanuts. 
It's a Peanuts holiday. Golden Girls. I'll go around the other side. And then we also have a Christmas tree and a larger dog kennel. There's a bunch of cat supplies, uh, carriers, and automatic litter box, and then other cat and pet paraphernalias. This large cat tower. And then some normal garagey stuff. So again, the sale is going to be Friday and Saturday, March 31st and April 1st. We are in Wood Forest. This is also the weekend of the neighborhood garage sale, so we expect it to be pretty busy. So get out here early to get the best deals. We open at nine o'clock both days. There is no appointment necessary for this sale. See you there.